Oh, it's like a hiking path trail. And somebody's at a picnic table. I wonder if he just witnessed the whole thing. Two girls jumping off of a moving train. Oh, and there's a lady there. In a power walker? All right. Oh, she wants us to go up to the observatory place. We're gonna peer out over the landscape. And we're gonna be like, hey, what's that? I see that over there. That's Arcadia Bay. Chloe can't keep up. This is a cool little area. Oh, and I like the totem. That almost kind of looks like the totem that was at the school. I wonder if they moved it. Or if it's just a similar totem. Hey, it's actually a pretty nice view. Glad you approve. And as your reward for making it up here, I have a new game for us to play. Another one? I like games. Deal with it. This is one I learned in theater class. It's all about improvisation. All right. So far, what I've learned about you is that you're into acting, lying, and playing games. What's your point? That you're either full of imagination or full of shit. Hmm. Let me know when you figure out which one. This game involves spying on people from afar. Luckily, we got some high-tech surveillance equipment right here. Let's fire it up. I wouldn't call it high-tech, but... I get, I get what you're saying. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Oh, it looks like it ate a quarter. She also has an anger problem. That blows. Ah. Uh. Well, shit. Shoot. That was my last quarter. You? Quarterless. Damn. Hey, maybe I can MacGyver something up. I've been told I'm pretty handy. Oh, yeah? Let's see what you got. We're gonna MacGyver up a quarter? <laughs> That's what I got from that conversation. Interesting. Rachel Mike. really wants to use this viewfinder. I'd love to get it working for her. I will do my best. What's Mikey have to say? My brother's not always an asshole. Oh, sorry about Drew. Not your fault. My brother's not always an asshole. Just most of the time. Forget it. Oh. All right. Well, I guess we're not going to be playing D&D &D with him anytime soon. All right. So we've got a sign here. There's got to be something with this viewfinder. Huh. Looks like I might be able to pry it open with the right tool. I see. So now, I just need to find something to pry open a viewfinder. Like a tire swing. All right, well, we're gonna go all the way down here? I've been saying sorry all morning. I admit it was really dumb to lock the keys in the car. You've been on me for three hours. Oh, shit. What does that mean? New dialogue option? Picnickers speak. Oh, wait a minute. Locked his keys in the car. I wonder. That's information. Yuck. Cliche much, AW and OL. Hey, wall. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe. Maybe once we overheard them, now wonder we have if I can to get talk that with quarter them. Out of the viewfinder. I'm working on it. Hey, spare some change? Sorry, we might have some leftover food when we're done. What? No, I'm not... What kind of food? This place has really gone downhill. Shh. She's right there. Jeez. Say it louder, why don't you? What about the wine? Uh, nothing else. Alright, well... <laughs> My hierarchy of needs goes pot, then beer. Than wine. Still, wino has a classy ring to it. So it definitely, I, I was right the first time. We overheard their conversation, and that is somehow going to give us 
an option to get their keys out of their car? I don't know. Let's sit down. We need to ponder this. Just a day in the park with Rachel Amber. You know when something kind of amazing is happening, you don't always stop to think about it right away? And then when you do think about it, you start thinking about it a lot. And the more you think about it, the crazier it seems until pretty soon you're psyching yourself out and then everything turns to shit. Yeah, let's not do that today. I agree. So, in order for this day to not turn to shit, we need to find a prior opener so we can get a quarter out of a viewfinder. I don't want to head down there just yet. All right, so... Literally, we have to find something up here. History placard. This Blackwall guy sure liked founding stuff that was already there. Founders keepers, I guess. Wait a minute, there was a dedication plaque on this bench over here. I wonder if... I wonder if I could use this to get the quarter out. Hmm. So now I just need something to get the dedication plaque out of there. What about the tire swing? If Max were here, she'd probably take a black and white photograph and call it Innocence Lost or some shit. What if I talk to Rachel? Uh, I'm thinking about prying open that viewfinder. Got a knife on you? A knife? Yeah. My mom took mine. Uh, no. How about a nail file? I guess you could stab someone with a nail file. Oh, right. Sh sure, let's try it. It's not gonna work. Victoria, what the hell? Chloe Price. Fluorine, uranium, carbon, potassium, uranium. Think I don't know that spells fuck you on the periodic table? I got in trouble for that, you carbon, uranium, nitrogen, tin. You called me a cunson, huh? Tin is SN. <laughs> Fuck you, bitch, you're so dead. You're, I was just gonna correct her. Wow. Awesome. Awesome, right on for Chloe to step up to Victoria. So now we use the nail file to get the plaque. The plate, the plaque, something like that. I knew that. If I would've known we would've had to have talked to Rachel that whole time, I would've done it a lot sooner. Wait, don't throw that away. That's na uh, Rachel's nail file. Stealing a dedication plate takes persistence. <laughs> I guess that's one way to look at it. Did we just throw that on the ground and it disappeared? What the hell? That's weird. All right, let's look at Steph. What did she text? Hey, heads up, Wells is on the war path. Oh no, seriously, just trying to help. Yeah, right, you killed me this morning. That's what the <laughs> that's what the GM does, dude. Also, thanks for playing with us. Mikey had a blast, he's cool. He's been down lately, not sure why. I know, but I know playing with you really meant a lot. Well, that's cool. At least we're making friends, cheering people up. We're annoying the principal. Let's get, let's just get this open. Where's got power? Activate. Hey, we did it. We actually got the quarter. Not to brag. I don't want to boast, so I'll let you do it for me. Chloe Price, you are truly the viewfinder whisperer. I stand in awe of your powers. Rachel smells like... Jasmine? Is she smelling me right now, too? Really should have showered this morning. All right, here's the game. 
You find some people for us to spy on, and then you and I will act out what they're saying and thinking. That's it? I do that in my head during, like, every class. See? You're a natural. Let's give it a try. Alright, so, uh... Oh, there's a couple right here. Alright. Let's see. Wanna come listen to some music? After this, wanna come home and listen to my Spotify playlist? Is it the kind of listening where you have to get under the covers to really appreciate the music? Yes, and clothes really mess with the acoustics, so... <laughs> <laughs> Funny jokes. Got them. Am I? Oh, uh, looking around to see more people. Uh, over here. What about this guy? Think this guy is married to a nutritionist? He's all like, I'm not allowed to eat this stuff at home. So. I love grease. I love grease. How can something that tastes so good be so wrong? Oh, dropped a fry on my suit. Now I'll have to burn it. Good thing I have a giant squirrel costume in the car. <laughs> <laughs> Is this thing like on a timer? I gotta do this quick. Uh, what about the grill? Hey, what do you say we barbecue some squirrels when we're done here? God, you just have the best ideas. Good God. What about the statue? They totally stole my third grade art project. Wow. You made that? Can't you tell? It does have a certain give zero fucks quality that I recognize. All right, and what else? We have to have something else over here, don't we? Oh, Speedwalker. This is the dude we saw before. Loving this guy. What's he thinking right now? Super wedgie. Stay away bees. Definitely has a super wedgie in those pink shorts. <laughs> no matter how fast I go, I'll never outwalk this wedgie. That's so tragic, but also beautiful in its own way. <laughs> <laughs> this is fun. Who's next? Oh, what's going on there? Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to hog the viewfinder. Ooh, <laughs> jackpot. Commence makeout session in three, two, one. Nailed it. Damn, they are really going at it. I feel like Rachel knows them. Uh, prostitutes? Wait, you're a prostitute? But I'm a prostitute. Now who gets paid? <laughs> Rachel? Hey, are you all right? What are we doing? Excuse me? Last I checked, you're supposed to be Chloe Price. Yet we've been ditching now for hours, and we haven't even gotten wasted yet. That's got to be against some school ditching rule. Uh... Okay. Uh... Hell yeah. The honor student wants to show the school delinquent how to party? Be my guest. How gracious of you. That was weird. That was very, very weird. What happened with her? Did she recognize those people? They have a bottle of wine. Let's steal it. Uh, okay. Or we could go try to find a liquor store instead? No. You shouldn't bring alcohol to a public park if you're not willing to share it with everybody, right? And fuck it. I just want to take something that's not mine. All right. Oh, damn. I'm going in. Try to keep up. What the fuck is wrong with her? She, like, flipped a switch. Um, can we help you? <sighs> oh, my God. Oh, she wants us to take it. Holy shit. Talk about committing to a performance. Better act fast. Swipe it. Well, they totally saw us together. Uh-oh. 
Oh, thank God. Please, this girl is in trouble. That's smooth. Go get help. Help Rachel. I need to get these two to focus on Rachel so I can swipe the wine. Who Here are we you go. waiting for? Go! Uh... Sterilize the wound. I, I've, I've seen this oh, kind shit. of thing before. This woman clearly has a wound that needs to be sterilized. I fucked it up. Do you happen to have any alcohol? Oh, I, I didn't see a up. wound. Look closer. In the meantime, I'll search for the booze. Hold on. There's something off about this. Are I you girls putting up. us on? Rachel, run! What the hell? We did it anyway. All right, well, and <laughs> she just shoves him. She's gonna be even more pissed. Wow. I fucked that up. So, maybe your acting could use a little work, but at least you committed to the performance. See, normally I would say no thanks, but I feel like Chloe would say hand it over and we're supposed to be playing as Chloe. Thanks. So. <laughs> I could use a drink after trying to keep up with you. I love how they're just still drinking it here out in the open. I am excessively sober right now. Right. Okay. Guess we're leaving now. That was such a weird ending to that scene. Like, what is happening? Evidently, we weren't that far away from Arcadia Bay because we both knew where that park was, seemingly, so we're just walking back. Whoa. Hey, check this out. What? Oh, the junkyard. Shit, we actually did end up here. Definitely, Rachel's definitely mad about something, or upset about something. It's, this is still weird though. And we're just admiring the junkyard, cool. Great. It's a pile of trash. Uh, yeah. An awesome pile of trash. Let's explore. You have fun, Chloe. I'm gonna go sit down. Rachel's been acting kind of standoffish ever since we left the park. What's her deal? I don't know, but that's pretty damn accurate. Call her out, let her be. You know what? I feel like if we call her out, that's what she would do to us. If I let her be, she's just gonna sit in sorrow and we might not get it out of her. So I feel like we're going to call her out. That's what Chloe would do. I've heard that actors are moody, but wow, Rachel. I'm not moody. I just need some space. Is that all right with you? Okay. Actually, no. I thought we were having a great day together. Why are you acting like this all of a sudden? I'm not acting like anything. I just want to be left alone right now. No, I don't understand. You can't just turn on me for no reason. I'm sorry, turn on you? I guess I forgot. It's always about how you feel, isn't it? Sad Chloe's fucking sad again. Maybe you should try giving a shit about other people for once. Are you serious right now? Fuck! Ugh. Uh... Okay, I still have no idea what's going on with Rachel, but 
Apparently, she gets smashy when she's angry. I can work with that. Score. Can I hit stuff? Give Rachel the bag, give Rachel a show. I feel like she wants to work it out of her, so we'll give her the bat. Here. If you really want to smash something, this should do the trick. Thinking about her needs, not ours. We're letting her do it. I asked you to leave me alone. Are you kidding me? I... I know you're the school princess and all, with the DA daddy and the perfect grades and all the perfect little Victoria chases kissing your perfect ass, but seriously, fuck you. Great. I'm leaving. See you around, Chloe. You can't leave! Watch me. Rachel, wait! Don't go! Oh shit. Why not? Because, because I don't want to ruin this the way I ruin everything else in my life. And what is this exactly? Oh, man. I honestly don't know. Because I felt like initially she was being very flirty and then the train ride was more friendly and then the park was more standoffish what the fuck do I pick you know what I feel like Chloe was in love with Rachel and she was expressing this to Max in the in game one, in, in Life is Strange. So we're gonna go with something more. But it's probably gonna get weird. Man, I'm gonna fuck this up. So I'm gonna say something more. I'm gonna do I it. I mean, fuck. Are you actually going to make me say it? Say what, exactly? You know, like, a friendship. But more. Ah. I know. Weird, right? It's just, today was the best day I've had since, since my dad died. And when I almost ruined it just now, the way I ruin everything, it made me realize whatever's going on between us is special. Come on, say something. Chloe, I, I, you know what? Forget it. This was really stupid. I mean, you're Rachel Amber and I'm Chloe Price. It's not that. It's just hard right now. And I can't talk about it. Why not? Because I can't. I know it isn't fair, but it's how it is. Goodbye, Chloe. What just happened? I'm not sure. Oh shit. Are we gonna go ape? Oh man, we're gonna go ape on the junkyard. Fuck this place. Hell yeah. Bottle. Smash. <laughs> All right, we, what else we got? Old monitor, smash. <laughs>
Hell yeah. We just saw, we're gonna get all smashy smash. Rachel's not the only one that can get smashy. Let's break this mirror. Maybe not. Space leave. Why is this significant? Oh, I guess leave was just a hit. It should have said a hit. All right, well, what did, what did uh, mom say here? Chloe, Chloe. Chloe, I'm worried about you. Please let me know you're okay. Oh man, why aren't we doing that? We told her we'd do better. I guess we're just so interested in smashing. Yeah. All right, I guess we just kicked that over. A mannequin, of course we gotta go for the headshot. You know she's fake, y you can't take your eyes off her. Who else do I know who fits that description? Yeah. Fuck off, Rachel. Oh shit, man, this is getting really brutal. <laughs> I've never understood your hard on for cameras, Max. You took a million pictures of us, and not one of them showed that you were gonna leave when I needed you most. Fuck cameras. Man, this is just like spiraling out of control. Uh, 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 wow. What is happening, dude? If you want to rip a family apart from the inside, it's important to bring the proper tools. Fuck you, David. So this is literally her going through everything that's causing her pain and just smashing it. That was the car. Wow. Holy shit, man. This is... This is nuts. Is that the blood on... Uh, that's gotta be rust, right? On, like, the floorboard? Jesus. Smash? I guess we're doing this. <laughs> wow, man, this is... This is deep. This is some dark stuff to start off episode one with. Is this how it's going to end? No way. There's no way it can end like that.